Welcome back. After weeks of rumors of one of the best high school recruits in Colorado, well, he made it official. He's heading to Iowa, not to the Hawkeyes, though, to Valley High School to play this fall. Justin Surrency from our sister station in Des Moines explains how the transfer went down and, more importantly, why is it happening? COVID-19 is causing an influx of athletes to see Iowa as an opportunity. What a great opportunity out here in Iowa. I think it'd be great for my football game and let alone my academics and for my family. Wednesday, Colorado's top-ranked football recruit and quarterback Jake Rubley confirmed to KDVR he will transfer to Valley High School since Colorado postponed football until spring. I need to play this season just for my football aspects and also academically. WHL 13 reached out to a number of parents of athletes at the high school who say at least two other Colorado athletes are also in town with Jake working out with the team. They all wish to remain off camera, but feelings were split on whether or not it should even be allowed to happen. The change is always uh, different in every aspect, but I mean, honestly, I think it could be a blessing in disguise. Rubley's father, TJ, is moving his mortgage lending business to Iowa. Iowa High School Athletic Association clearly states that a student is immediately eligible if their parents have a sudden change in residence, but a student intending to establish residency must show that a student is physically present in the district for the purpose of making a home and not solely for school or athletic purposes. The business opportunity combined what mom really appreciates with the school and, and, and you know, Jake obviously getting a chance to play football, it, it really is... Uh, it's really the right thing for us to do. A week ago, Landon Nelson from California, where football has been pushed to December, announced his family was moving to Iowa so he can enroll at Valley while his sister attends Iowa State University. Rubley does have connections to Iowa. His father, TJ, was a star high school athlete in Davenport before playing in the NFL. Jake will now be playing alongside fellow Kansas State University commit and current Valley running back Jaden Williams. Both plan to be Wildcats in 2021. Rubley plans to enroll in college this spring, and in the end, since he can't play in Colorado, Iowa offers him a senior experience. You know, Dad, they're playing in Iowa. They're emphatic about Iowa. They finished the baseball season, and no other state has even bothered to have sports during the pandemic. Coming up tonight at 10, we'll hear from Siouxland coaches on their thoughts on having out-of-state transfers play this season.